Now, not to mock the guy, okay? I'm mocking the concept. But people who say, Oh, I want to take better care of my health. Um, what do I do? What do I do? I know, I'll buy a ring that tracks my sleep. Bro, that is the just cop-out way to feel like you're being productive, okay? You don't need to track things when you're slodging down Zog Choi Goy Slop fast food five days a week, okay? You, you, you don't need a ring. You need to get your ass in the gym. You need to drink a fuckload of water. Get some sunlight. Connect with God. Don't track. You don't need a ring to, 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 to get a sleep. Okay, here's how you get high quality sleep. Now notice, I didn't say you need lots of sleep. I said you need high quality sleep. I'm not a big fan on long sleeping. I'm a fan of when you do sleep, it's excellent. This is how you do it. Cold room, dark room, put tape over your mouth so you're forced to breathe nasally during your sleep. Now, if you notice, you have nose hairs inside your nose and not inside your mouth. Why is that? Well, the nose, our nose hairs, one, they catch the nasties. They are filters. They filter the air. And number two, they actually warm up the air that we breathe in so it can be readily used by our lungs, okay? Our mouth does not have a filter and does not warm up air. It makes it bad. You can get a whole host of sickness and illness simply from breathing through your mouth. So you just put tape on, okay? You do those three things. You have quality, quality sleep. You don't need a ring. Like that should not be step one. Step one should be to go and splurge on the highest quality foods that you can possibly get your hands on, on a gym membership. If you're new on a personal training, get somebody to show you what to do and how to do it. That's what you need to be spending your money on, not a ring that tells you how good you slept, please.